Šī rīta olimpiskajā turnīra spēlē starp Krievijas un Slovākijas valstsvienībā pēc spēles metienu sērijā pie uzvars tika Slovākija. Man saruns biedrs šobrīd Rīgas Dinamo slovāku pārstāvs Roberts Petrovickis. Robert, did you have a chance to watch this game this morning? Yes, I did. I, I watched uh, pretty much whole game and uh, it was very interesting. It was a good hockey game and uh, you know, good result for Slovakia. Uh, did you miss the beginning of the practice because of the game? No, I didn't. I was right on time. <laughs> okay, great. Uh, what was the main factor uh, why Slovakia uh, won this match? Well, they uh, improved. They played much better than the first game against Czech. You know, they were more organized. You know, still the power play is not that it's not working yet. But they were, you know, going up and down together. And of course, goalies are unbelievable. And every team, right now, I was watching some games before, and goalies is gonna be a big factor in every game. You know, whoever is gonna allow less than one goal in the, in the game that's gonna win the game or maybe tournament and uh, like I said it was a great hockey game it was up and down you know I don't think Russians they look that sharp like against Latvia first game but uh, you know great result for Slovaks and uh, good for confidence for goalie for defense for forwards for whole team was it easy for you to watch was it emotional or you you just watch like hockey expert well, you know, I grew up with those guys, you know, there was most of the guys that are my age, you know, this, all my friends, we all played uh, in the teams together, in the big tournaments together, in the world championships together. Yeah, sometimes I wish I'm there, you know, but, you know, I know how it is on the ice. I played the tough games, I played, uh, you know, bad games with them, and I spent lots of time time with those guys, and... Yeah, it's 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 not easy to watch, but I know how it is on the ice and off the ice, and I just I kind of live with them when I watch the game. Uh, how do you think? Uh, do Latvians have any chance against Slovakia? Well, it's uh, you know it's open. I mean, they their first game they they started off with uh, against very tough team against Russians, and uh, of course now they have a couple days off, but they have a big game tonight against. Uh, or during the night, I don't know, this morning against uh, Czechs. And, uh, you know, they know they made a couple mistakes in the first game, and this is going to be a good experience for them. You know, I know it's tough to play against the best players in the world. And, uh, you know, I think they, uh, if they play a little bit better together, they can, uh, they can you never know, be, be surprised. But they, they all, we all know, I know they're a good hockey team. And, and uh, against Slovaks, well, of course, I'm going to cheers for my home country. But... I'll wake up, I'll watch it, maybe with some friends here, and, uh, you know, it's going to be enjoyable. You know, we have a couple a couple beers with it and just talk about it and just enjoy the game. Because of this morning's game be uh, between Slovakia and Russia, do you have to buy beer for Dinamo Riga guys? <laughs> uh, no, I, you know, it's, uh, I hope Slovakia will win against uh, Latvia because if I come here next morning, <laughs> it'll be tough to, tough to listen to some guys here. But uh, no, I mean, it's, 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 uh, uh, there's little side bets going on here, you know, just a little, you know, a little trash talk. But uh, it's part of the being a hockey player, part of the being, uh, being in a team, and, uh, you know, we all enjoy it. Okay, thank you very much.